Good afternoon and welcome to a New Year's Eve home vlog. So every New Year's Eve we have a whole bunch of traditions that we do even down to eating jalapeno poppers every year and this year is not any different. So we have all the supplies that we need. We've got eggs, we've got grapes, we've got jalapeno poppers, we've got a lemon pig that we're gonna make. It's gonna be a fun night. It feels like kind of gloomy out today though. That's okay. We're not letting that get our spirits down. Happy New Year, everybody. Let's do this. Happy New Year. It is New Year's Eve. I know Tim already started the video and said Happy New Year's and kind of told you what we were doing. It's still very gloomy. Look, it's like dark out. Isn't that wild? It's just been a gloomy, gloomy day. So um, let me go see what these little buddies are doing because they were doing some Lego. I don't know what they're doing now. Let's go check on them. Do you like presents? Yeah. Oh. That's my present. Who's a present? A That's present? A present. For what? What is it? That's the nameplate for the cruise ship right there. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's my present. It is a present. It is. You're right. That Ooh. was your present. Jackson, we have to find two of these like this. Uh, find me another one of those. Uh, I need to have this hit. With it. Oh yeah, I don't want the one with the claw with it. Did you? No, I want one without a claw. Without a claw? Without a claw. There's another claw one though. You found another claw one? Yeah. Did you find one without a claw? Uh, I can't find one. Hmm, keep looking. So here's the progress so far on the Stranger Things Upside Down Lego set. Looks pretty good, but I feel like we're gonna have to make it. One of our goals for 2023 is to finish this Lego set. Oh yeah, well, we're almost done. Are you? There's a fourth one. There's a fourth one? Yeah. Show mommy. What are there four of? What are there four of? A fourth one. Okay. What are they? There's one, two, three, four, five. There's five? There's a fifth one? No, just four. One, two, three, four, five. What are they? They are just like black hot dogs. They are, they are black hot dogs. What is it for? Well, I don't know. Oh, we haven't gotten to that part what yet. What are they for? What are they for? What are they oh. for, mommy? I don't know. I have to look at the instructions and see if it if it says. Are there hot dogs in this one in the in the regular upside no. down or the right the the right side up? We're on we're on this step is two hundred and seventy. This is what they're talking about. <laughs> so it's a, he said. Why is there a black hot dog? And we were like, I don't know. Why is there a black hot dog? We have other sets with hot dogs, like Mickey Mouse sets. Oh, yeah. Look at that. What? That that thing goes with all the pictures. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, somebody made that for us. The ant band. Yeah. The ant band? Yeah. What's that? It's up there. An ant? Oh, ampersand. He's saying ampersand. Oh. Yeah. Oh, look at all that J. <laughs> yeah, the J. The T and the J are for mommy and daddy's other names. What are mommy and daddy's other names? What's mommy's other name? What do I call mommy? Jennifer. Whoa. <laughs> he does. I'm not expecting to. And what do your full name? Out of what that. do? What's daddy's other name? How, when have you ever said Jennifer? Timofer. Timofer. <laughs> <laughs> Very close, buddy. That's, that's 100 true. <laughs> so while they are finishing up, they're not going to finish the Lego set tonight. But while they're finishing up the like bag that they were on, I am getting today's video up. It's a little bit late. It's like almost six o'clock now, but the video should have gone up around six o'clock. I also have to start our traditions, our New Year's Eve traditions. So um, I need to start, we gotta get the lemon pig started. We gotta start our prosperity, our, our jalapeno poppers of prosperity. And then for dinner, we're gonna have some um, udon, some veggie udon. And so we're gonna use that as our long life noodle tradition and see who gets the longest noodle, who's gonna be the lucky one for 2023. I think that it'll probably be Tim will be the lucky one because like I said in an earlier video, he is the lucky one of the two of us. So let's see if that holds true. And he's the lucky one to get the long noodle. Um, also, I feel like we're definitely coming down with something. There's something going around and I feel like Jackson and I both have it. <laughs> and 
Um, so yeah, so that's another thing that's happening tonight. So it almost doesn't feel like New Year's Eve. I don't know if anybody else feels this way this year. What's going on? No, I just have some of your makeup. Um, if you want to, but I don't know if you need any. You're beautiful without it, buddy. But I want some. Like what? Um, some makeup. Oh. Okay, let's go look. He likes it when I, like, when I do my makeup. Um, he likes it when I put my, like, brush. I, I have, like, an, a brush that doesn't have anything on it. And I'll, like, brush his cheeks, and he likes that. So, that's what he means. But, I don't know about you guys, though. But it kind of doesn't feel like New Year's Eve, right? Does anybody else, did anybody else have that feeling that it didn't really feel like New Year's? Because that's kind of how I feel this year. I, I feel like maybe because I'm getting sick, maybe because I had to work today and I was... But yeah, so long story short, uh, I gotta get this video up and then we're gonna start our New Year's Eve traditions, even though it doesn't really feel like New Year's. So that's kind of where I'm at today. So even though it is 73 degrees outside and it's dark too, we decided that a good treat for New Year's Eve would be, what are you drinking? I'm drinking hot chocolate. Some hot chocolate? Well, you were saying hot cocoa? Yeah. That's okay. It could be either or. Do you like it? Yeah. Is it good? Yeah. So we went with Swiss Miss, no sugar added, 99.9% .9 caffeine free hot cocoa mix. So we had this snowman activity that I kept asking Jackson, like, hey, do you want to do this before Christmas? You want to do this? You want to do this? Guess what he's doing right now? Yeah. So basically you just decorate the snowman in any way you want to, and then there's some lights that can go around it. Whoa, a piece of candy. There's one more. Yeah, there's two, two more. I wonder why. Where, is there any underneath him? Pick, pick up the snowman. Is there anything underneath him? Oh! Magic! I forgot this present does. Yeah, there you go, you did it. 100% complete. It's beautiful. Wait, let's see. What's Daddy doing? That, that, my, my, my foodie set. Your foodies? Wait, where are you going? All right, so Jackson. That's my oh, Spider-Man. It's your Viewmaster. I wonder if we could show you guys. This thing is so cool. I don't know if we could actually show it to you. Let me see if I can get Tim's help. But Jackson wanted to put the snowman on the Christmas tree. Look at that. What's this? Oh, this is our little turtle guy. I love it. Okay, let me see if I can show Which you. Can you sounded, see? Which one sounded heavier? So this yeah, is the new Viewmaster. Look how it's like all chromed out. It looks so cool. It's very light. It's much lighter yeah, than the old Viewmaster. But check that out. Uh -oh. This one bounces high. Oh, okay. Doesn't that look awesome? If you had two eyes, like if there were two cameras, I the, the Viewmaster is now 3D. Yeah, it's awesome. Whoa. Let's see what's There's like a pterodactyl. Okay, so I think it's time. What time is it? It's time to maybe start our, our jalapeno poppers of prosperity. Oh, yeah. Are we going to do like a, a New Year's Eve celebration with him before midnight? Yeah. Okay. I'm excited. I just wanted to mention real quick. 4.30 this afternoon. What about it? That's when the fireworks started. Oh, I, I forgot to tell them. <laughs> yeah, the fireworks were going off a minute ago and I was like, it wasn't even dark yet. Yeah, it was 4.30 in the afternoon. I'm like, you can't still see daylight. Them. There's no point. What are you wasting your money for? That's right. They're very expensive. Yeah. So we got some little poppers, like some party poppers. I'll see you poppers. So Jackson can, we can do like a little mini celebration. It's going to be so it? cute. Should we do it, bud? <laughs> Maybe we'll have, we'll do dinner first. Like we'll have our jalapeno poppers of prosperity. He'll have his dinner, and then we'll um, and then we'll set him off. He's not listening to me, but that's what we're gonna do. We have our jalapeno poppers of prosperity in the air fryer. I'm gonna start prepping my veggies for my long life noodles. I got my garlic here, and uh, yeah, getting ready for our New Year's Eve traditions to start. All right, it is that time, that time of year. It's that time of year. Is that Where what Olaf was talking about? The world falls asleep, and there's something here. And we eat jalapeno poppers, right? Yeah. Right, bud. Oh, how, Olaf. Yeah. These At that the time of year. The yeah. Oh, okay. These are the colors of the rainbow. These are the colors of the rainbow. What Is are that? They? Ooh, careful. Uh, orange, yellow, green, blue, and violet. These, These are, are the 
are the colors of the rainbow. These are the colors of the rainbow. You were jamming out a little too hard there, bud. I was sorry. Because you were, you were yelling it. You're like in a screamo band. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, he loves that. That's his favorite song. Love loves it. Right, what did we do? I don't know the the. I don't remember. I just know that we ate them, and then we were like prosperity. Oh, so, we were prosperous afterwards. Yeah. Okay. And I feel like so we forgot to do this last year. Somebody left a comment and said no jalapeno poppers, and I was like, oh I no. Don't like to my nose. <laughs> mm. okay. Wait, bring it over here. I'll help you. Mmm. <laughs> Honestly, even if these don't bring us prosperity, they're so delicious. I'm gonna eat them anyway. TGI Fridays. So 2022. Here's to 2023. Was our most successful year as far as in every aspect of the word. You know, like we were able to get pregnant again. Jackson had a really great year. Um, you know, he's doing really well, like health wise yeah. and um, development wise and Everything was just really great. Like 2022 was a really great year. We got to travel to all the places we wanted to go to. Yeah. And um, I hope that next year is, is just tomorrow. I hope next year yeah. tomorrow is, is just as prosperous. So, and I hope the same for you. So it's time to celebrate? Yeah. Yeah. I might celebrate my party Yes, you can. You want to go do it? You ready, buddy? Yeah. Okay. I did my party creamer. Okay. So we had a, a knock at the door and it was our Amazon. I didn't think Amazon was delivering today, but it was our Amazon package. And we got another one of these for Jackson because his other one broke immediately. Yeah, because so, it, the battery's dying, so that's why it's like going to the ground right now. Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> but if you watch the Christmas video, I got a lot of comments that were like, what is that ball thing? Can you link it? And I didn't link it because it wasn't great quality and I didn't want to like pass bad info along to you guys. So I feel like I'll link this one. This one was a little bit more expensive. We found the, the non-expensive version of the ball too. The ball is even more expensive than this thing. Yeah. So. Well, because do you remember how we were playing with the other one and then we kept dropping it? It didn't actually work. Yeah, and it, it just broke into like some people. What are you doing, buddy? You looking at yourself? Ah! Yeah. Who's that little handsome buddy? Ooh, I have makeup on me right now. You uh, you have makeup on you right now? Yeah. What what kind of makeup did you put on? Um, I put, um, but can I do this? Yes, yes, can yes. Yes, yes, yes. So I want to tell you a really funny story really quick before we do the party poppers. So I asked Jackson what, you know how we call Jackson buddy and, and we like, we can't call both of them buddy. We can't call the baby buddy and Jackson buddy because they won't know who we're talking to. So I said, Jackson, what should we call the baby when the baby's born? You know how we call you buddy. What should we call him? And then he told me that we should call him toenail. So there you go. Baby toenail. Coming at you live in March. One, two, three. Whoa! <laughs> that was cool. Here it is. Happy New Year! Right, this time we're gonna count down, okay? You ready? Okay. So what are we Five. Oh, you ready? Hold my hand. Ready? Five, four, three. You gonna count with me, babes? One, two, three. No, no, down. Count down, down, down. Five, Five four. four. Count three. Three. Say two. Two. One. What? Whoa. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Three, two, one. Whoa. Whoa. Happy New Year. Three, two, one. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Did you like those party poppers, buddy? Yeah. Jackson, what is all this stuff? Confetti. Confetti? Yeah. Confetti. That can't get into that infinity song. There's a confetti song? Yeah. And here's what? a guy that sings it. it? How does it go? It's, I don't know how it goes. Where did you hear it? It's from my car yesterday when I went into the playground. Oh, just today? Oh. No, the other day. You With you and me? Uh, and you heard a confetti song? Wow. No idea what this confetti song is. I don't know. All right, well, he's hip to the new music. I think so. Well, Happy New Year! 
there. It's, what time is it? 7.21 on December 31st. Happy New Year. Yeah. So, I have a question for you now that it's New Year's and it's 2023 for you. Do you have any special plans that you want to do in 2023? Any goals that you want to Anywhere tell you want to go? Anything that you, any words of wisdom? Uh, no. No, none? I, um, I'm just going to have that on another day. You, you want to tell me on another day? Yeah. <clears throat> Is there anywhere that you want to go, want to visit in 2023? Yeah. yeah. Where? Uh, at the playground. You want to go, you to, wanna a go to the playground more in 2023? Is there any any special, um, any any other special things you want to do? Um, yeah. Like what? what? Uh, like some more party dreamers. You want to do more, more party poppers? He calls them party dreamers. You want to do some more of these party poppers? You like them? Yeah. Okay. Well, the good news is I think they'll be on sale tomorrow. <laughs> they were only a dollar. <laughs> now's a good time to buy. Okay, well there, there you have it. There's Jackson's goals and dreams for 2023 is to go to the playground more. Um, um, get which, more party poppers. We go to the playground kind of a lot. So okay. this will be a... You gotta go with 10 times a day. <laughs> so right now I am going to make our, I'm trying to find the better lighting. I'm going to make our long life noodles with, um, it's like a garlic noodle recipe that I found that I'm kind of modifying because it called for tofu, but we didn't have tofu. We were doing like a veggie version. So let's make some dinner, some new year's Eve, long life noodle, new year's Eve tradition dinner. Let's do it. Let's see who's the lucky one. Who gets the longest noodle? Okay, so Jackson's getting ready to go to bed and on New Year's Eve, you're supposed to kiss who you love at midnight. So will you give mommy a, a love kiss? I just did right now. Can I have a kiss before midnight? I got my New Year's kiss. got my veggies all prepped, my pepper, my scallions, my mushrooms. I'm gonna do just a little bit from this bag as well, the vegetable stir fry bag. And then I just need to make my sauce, which is basically just gonna be soy sauce, hoisin sauce, and vinegar. All right, I've got my mushrooms cooking. I think these are about done. I'm gonna add my scallions and my peppers. Okay, I forgot to show you a few steps there because I needed both my hands, but I think dinner is almost ready. And I'm excited to see who gets the longest noodle. Who do you think it'll be? I bet it's gonna be Tim. It smells really good though. All right, all right, I just got done getting Jackson into bed. I don't know if that's gonna last for very long because it sounds like they're setting off fireworks right outside his window. <laughs> <laughs> well, and it's like nonstop. Right? Like they're, they're like, keep, they keep going. Right. Okay, so dinner's done. Ooh, I who forgot got the that, longest noodle? Well, you have to, that's, I, I want you to pick the bowl so I, so we can, I don't want to be in charge of picking the bowl. Okay. Okay, so let's see, which one do you want? Ooh, see here's my thought process. This one has less in it. Does it? So it has to have the longest noodle. I don't think it has less. Oh, Look at it. Does. Yeah, it's got, it's got less. Oh jeez, okay. So I think I'm picking this one. What happens if you get the longest noodle? You're the lucky one. Oh. You get like a good luck, good luck here. Ooh, you're the lucky one. Okay. Yeah. So let's see, so I get this one? Yeah. Do we All have right. to like stretch out every noodle in the bowl? I don't know, I guess if you think it's a really long one, we have to... Gotta tape measure it. So here's my thought. I think what we do, cause we're not gonna measure every noodle. I think what we do is we pick, just like go in with your fork and the first noodle that comes out, whoever has the longest one. I think we should do best two out of three. What? Well, because okay. that doesn't seem right, fair. Right, Just one. Okay. Okay. All right. So, like rock paper scissors. Oh, oh! Look at this one. 
That's like two noodles in one. No, it's just like stripped. Oh, they're, okay. They're interconnected. All right, so let me see. All right. No, I can't do the one that's attached to my fork. That's not fair. Right? Okay, let me. You can't choose one. You just I'm don't. not. Ooh. Okay, mine, mine's definitely longer. See, I told you, I told you it was gonna be Tim. Oh, I got an even longer one. What, really? Look at my. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be the lucky one. You have the longest noodles. Mmm. So I picked this bowl. Um, this is delicious. I will definitely be making this again. I wanna like put the recipe down below for you, but I didn't really follow the recipe. I kind of like went a little rogue. I added some things that they said that they didn't say to add, and I added more, way more soy sauce than it said. I added less hoisin than it said, and then I added more uh, rice vinegar. So I, I'll leave the recipe down below as kind of like a starting point, but I think you can kind of do whatever you want with this, and it's gonna be good. So, yeah, this is delicious. And I won the long life noodle, like good luck thing. So that's exciting. I'm gonna have good luck in 2023. Yeah, but the true test is if Tim likes it, because Tim doesn't like noodles. That's pretty good. Pretty all right. Is it? Yeah. Are you just saying that? No, I like it. But I do have to admit, you gave me very small noodles. I didn't. You picked the bowl. That's why I said I you picked the a, bowl. I think what you did is it was a. It was like a. It's like a. <laughs> like reverse psychology. Reverse psychology. You 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 put all those shorter noodles in the small. No, bowl. I didn't. They, I think they were the same. I wasn't cheating. Hmm. Okay. Listen, you're lucky. You're lucky all on your own. So I, I deserve a little luck. It's funny how history repeats itself because back when Bandit was alive, we would have to console him during fireworks. And now Jackson is having a hard time sleeping because there are fireworks going out, going off in the neighborhood. I'm going to go outside and see if we can see any of them though, because that would be nice to see them. Uh, see like what's, what's keeping Jackson awake. I feel like there's nobody out on my street right now. But there has to be fireworks somewhere. It's so loud. There are absolutely no people out on my street at all. I don't know where these fireworks noises are coming from. So I think I'm gonna add a new tradition to our New Year's Eve festivities. Huh. And that is uh, eating every sweet in the house so that on January 1st, you can start your New Year's resolution. <laughs> you know, like I'm gonna start running tomorrow. Again, I, I was running all before Hawaii and then like right before we left for Hawaii, mm -hmm. my hips started hurting me. And so I was like, all right, let me cool off on that. Haven't ran since. And now my hip is feeling better. So tomorrow I'm gonna start running again. Mm. Take it easy. Maybe do like a mile, mile and a half. Nice easy run in the morning. And work my way back up to my three that I was doing, maybe even past that, maybe to four. 2023 is gonna be a wild time. But yeah, so now we're just like eating every cookie in the house. We ate all of our Christmas cookies. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. I like this tradition and I'm here for it. All right, it's time for the Prosperity Lemon Pig. Okay, so I'm gonna make this cut first. Okay, nose cut. Mouth, mouth cut. Mouth? Do I need to take this little stem out? No, I don't think so. I think you just cut through it. Okay, it's, that's the tough part. Mm, you, I believe in you. So will you pull me out some cloves? Yeah. So I guess I should tell you, in case this is your first New Year's Eve with us, we do a lemon pig every year for the past, I don't know, like three or four years now. Yeah. So you're going to need a lemon. You're going to need a few cl uh, cloves. A couple of cloves. Whole cloves, yeah, for the eyes. Some uh, Toothpick. toothpicks for the legs. And then a little piece, this is too big, but a little piece of aluminum foil that you can twist up into a, oh no, I'm sorry, into a tail. Okay, that's num eye number one. Okay. Eye number two is going right there. And where did this come from? A lot of people ask, I even got a message today from Ray from Diz Life of Ours. She's like, where, like, what, where did it come from? So um, basically I'll put a, the original post right here so you can see it. But it was just something that people did for good luck. And I was like, hey, this is gonna be our New Year's Eve tradition. It was a 1970s dinner party thing. Yeah. I don't know that it was ever for good luck. Yeah, it was for good luck. Was it? Yeah. I thought it was just like to have a centerpiece on the table. No, it was a good luck thing. So 
Once the pennies fall out, and I think this is something that we made up. I think the pennies falling out was like a thing that we just kind of did on our own. But once the pennies fall out of the mouth, so we're gonna put as many pennies in the mouth. Some people do it differently. Some people do one pig per person. So let's say you have a family of three. Some people might do three separate lemon pigs per person. We're gonna do one and put three pennies in the mouth. As soon as all of the pennies fall out, hopefully something good will happen on that day. So now that's why I'm just, you know, pre-making my holes in there. Okay. So that it's nice and easy. So you're like almost done. This was very quick. Yeah, that's why I was, I'm a professional lemon picker now. Okay. Should Let's... he be very tall? Should I give him like short hind legs? Well, he should so have he has short... more of like a stature. No, he should have short legs because I think pigs have shorter legs, right? Yeah. Okay, let me see him. Yeah, that's a good looking lemon pig. Yeah, right there. Yeah. He's got to give him a little booty butt tail. His ears are a little weird, Shh. but... <laughs> and we have to put his, his coins in. So some people messaged me and said like, Somebody won a thousand dollars on the day that their what? coins fell out. Yeah, they. I think they like did a lottery ticket and won a thousand dollars. A thousand dollars? Yeah. I think yeah. we had something really good happen one year on the day that the that the um the coins came out, but I can't remember what it was. But yeah, like we. I I, I feel like it's a good tradition to start. If you haven't ever already started it, I would start it. Good things happen. Possibly. It's a it's a known fact. Good things happen to at least one person. Yeah. So, I don't know. I mean, what what is there to lose? A lemon. A lemon and that's a couple of pennies. You don't even lose the pennies. Yeah, I think you should sure. do it. Let's see. Let's see him. Should we name him this year? Hmm. What should a name be? What's a good name for a pig? Um, Babe. <laughs> you can't just steal some other pig's name. <laughs> What's be... the pig's name in Charlotte's Web? Charlotte. No, that's the spider. The spider's name is Charlotte? Yeah. Oh. Some pig. Wilbur. Wilbur. That's true. Yeah, maybe. And then you gotta put the pennies inside the mouth. Yes. So, get in there little pennies. Alright, let me look. Let me see. Yeah, so there you go. So there's our lemon pig. And so, we made up the tradition that as soon as the pennies fall out, mm -hmm. then you take the pig Take the pennies out, the, the sticks out, and the aluminum foil out. Mm -hmm. Throw it into the nearest body of water you can find. Yeah. Just for good luck. We, that, you know, I don't could know. Could be a bucket. If you I don't, don't have a body of water near you. I don't know why we said that, but yeah, that's what, we, that's what we've been doing. So, there, there's our pig. Yeah, just look at it from this side. Yeah, it looks great. Because this ear looks good. This ear's a little... A little wonky. A little far back. A little wonky ear. That's his name. A little wonky ear. <laughs> So yeah, so there's a third tradition down. What if his name is, is, is instead of Wilbur, it's Willy, like Willy Wonka. Oh, okay, Willy. he's got a wonky ear. Willy the pig. Willy leave leave some ear. comments down below if you have a better name for our lemon pig. Also, did you name your lemon pig? What did yeah. you name it? What did you name it? Stephen? So, it's currently 11 o'clock. We did it. We made it, everybody. <laughs> Happy New Year. Happy New Year. It's getting harder and harder to stay up till oh, midnight. We definitely are not like up, especially now that I'm like super pregnant. It's, a, I don't think I, I guess I stayed up till midnight yesterday. But. <laughs> the story starts to unravel. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's, it's harder and harder for me to do. So, and this is our first year being pregnant during New Year's. Yeah. So yeah, this is like a. Just tired all around. So we have half an hour till the new year. Okay. So I wanted to ask you, uh -oh. what are some things that, what were some like good 2022, that sounds weird, 2022 moments? What were some, some of your favorite moments of 2022? She asks the man with the worst memory. <laughs> oh, no. uh, I really enjoyed Hawaii this year. Mm -hmm. I liked Anna Maria Island this year. Mm -hmm. I liked, uh the cruises that we did this year okay so traveling traveling okay and i really like traveling this year okay there was the pregnancy yeah like finding out and everything like that i was excited the pregnancy, <laughs> the pregnancy. <laughs> i think that's it's hard because we do um a video almost every day it's it is hard to remember all of the cool things that we did yeah i swam with manatees this year yeah um i tried to swim with sharks this year yeah 
That's that's two two animals that I swam with. Right. Well, so we we struck out swimming with sharks both times. Right. But well, I know no, that's not true. I did swim with sharks the first time. I just didn't see them. They were there. They were there. Yeah. <laughs> because we threw a drone up and we saw them. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. So I think we did a lot of memorable things though, for sure. The pregnancy definitely finding out we were pregnant was very exciting. Mm -hmm. And I even, I remember the day that we found out and I was so shocked. So the day that we found out, should we tell them the actual day? Yeah. When was it? It was when we were going to the outlets. Remember we were leaving to go to the outlets and you literally were like, I think we should take a pregnancy test. And I was like, no. And you were like, yeah, I think we should take one. So we had a pregnancy test from when Jack, when I found out I was pregnant with Jackson. So it would, it would is almost three years old, this mm -hmm. pregnancy test. And I'm thinking like, well, this isn't even going to work. And then immediately it was like, yeah, you're pregnant. Yeah. <laughs> and then we had to go to the outlets and like, I mean, we didn't have to, but we, you know, we had this day planned. So we went to the outlets and we went to, I think Portillo's. Yeah. But yeah, it was that day that we found out we were pregnant. So it's an exciting day. It was very yeah. exciting. Yeah. All right. So I looked, looked through and I found a few more things. Oh yeah. We had to go through the pictures. RV stay at Fort Wilderness. Yes. It was great. Jackson riding a pony for the first time. Yes. And I think that's something we might try to do again. Mm -hmm. So that'll be cool. Um, another thing that I'm going to do just as like something fun is I'm going to link our top 10 videos of the year. Okay. So our most viewed top 10 videos of 2022 spoiler alert it's a lot of cruising you guys like watching cruises yeah so good news i like going on them yeah that was another thing that we went on um four cruises this year so we did a lot of cruising do we go on five cruises this year yeah wow five cruises this year okay so next year we're not going to be going on as many cruises no <laughs> we just we can't it's like not feasible with the baby but also, yeah, I just thought that I think we're going to expand and do some other things. But yeah, that that's, I'm going to do the top 10 videos of 2022. I'll link them in the description and in the pinned comment down below. But it was, it was a, it was a lot of cruising were like our top videos. So. Like so yeah, I think that's the thing though. I think that's the part of like the beauty of, of our channel. One of the things that I really like is that we do so many things together Yeah. because like that's, sort of like what the channel's based on is like is like doing something every day together yeah so it's very and i think that's we talked about this a little bit in another video um that's a little bit of an older video but somebody was asking how how do we have like such a healthy relationship when we like live together work together spend every moment together how does that how does that work you know right. how does it how is it so successful and we made a video where we kind of talked about that a little bit and um i think that that's one of the one of the like blessings from the channel is that we get to experience new things together all the time right and now having kids it's it's even newer we're even experiencing more new things some of the things that we've already experienced we're experiencing again with kids right and so it's all new yeah and so i think just i don't know i, I feel like youtube has been such a um just such a positive, such a positive thing in our lives. But it, it is, it's, it's all because of you guys. But long story short, thank you guys so much. Yeah. You made 2022 such a great year for us. And I hope, year. I hope that we could make 2022 a good year for you somehow in some way. Even in like the smallest way, I hope 2020, that- 2022? Yeah, oh, uh, yeah, last year, this yeah. year, yeah. So yeah, so let's go crack some eggs. Let's do it. Let's get our, our grapes Can't together. Can't make any omelets. No. Time to be popping some bottles. Some with some Martinelli sparkling blush. <laughs> <laughs> from fresh apples and cherries. Ooh. I didn't realize it was cherries too. Yeah, it's delicious. So this is 100% juice and contains no alcohol. Good old Martinelli's. But it's really good. Okay, you pour the champagne. Okay. And I will do the grapes. Okay. okay. I got right. the eggs ready. We might have to do this egg thing after midnight. We've got Miley and Dolly on right now. They're celebrating New Year's Eve together. They're saying, I will always love you. Yeah. We have one minute. Oh my gosh. We have our grapes, our 12 grapes. We have our champagne, our fake champagne. So for every, like when, is it right before 
or right after? When do right we do after. It? We do it after. After? Okay, and then we have to try to real quick tell our 12 things that we want for the year. So you take, you eat a grape for every 12, I guess for every month, I don't know. Right. 12, 12 things that you want to have happen in 2023. 12 goals, 12 wishes, whatever you want to call it. 10. Five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. Do we oh, we cheers. Yes. <laughs> then cheers. And then we cheers. And then we drink. Mm. Oh, now grapes. Okay, but happy New Year's. Happy New Year. I'm gonna have a real kiss though. Okay. Because I feel like that one didn't really work. Okay. Um, go ahead. What I want to do? Yeah. RV. RV? You want right. to buy one? No. I want to do Stay another RV stay. Okay. Um. I'm gonna go to Tokyo. We say this every year. Oh, happy and healthy birth. Mm. That was supposed to be the first one. Yes, happy and healthy birth. 100%. I hope the baby is happy and healthy. And me, too. Yeah. I don't want to go on an Alaskan cruise next year, but I want to have one booked for 2024. Okay. Um, I want to read more books. Oh. Yeah. I would like to teach Jackson to ride a bicycle. Next year? Mm -hmm. I think that's too soon. You sure? You already know how to ride a bike with training wheels. But is that how, is that how old they are? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Okay. <laughs> I want to start driving. I talked about this as one of my goals for this, the end of this year, and it didn't really pan out that way. So I'd like to start driving. You hear that? Yeah, a lot of fireworks yeah, going on out um, there. This year, 2023, I'd like to really do that. Yeah, I'd like to go to Super Nintendo World. Oh, yeah. I This is something that Tim said um, one year for New Year's, and it always makes me laugh. I want to meet Ryan Seacrest for some reason. I want to meet Ryan Seacrest. <laughs> for some reason. I That's literally what you said. Wait, well, did you already eat yours for Ryan Seacrest? Yeah, I read mine for Ryan Seacrest. Oh, okay. Um, I'm ahead of you. I got... I got Six left. Oh no, how many do I have? Like eight. I want to spend more time with like friends and family. Okay. Yeah. I would like to visit the Grand Canyon. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's actually going to happen. Okay. But I like the idea of going to the Grand Canyon. All right. I kind of want to like learn a new skill. Okay. Like sewing or okay. like knitting. All right. Or something like that. Or something like, yeah. Okay. Like that. Okay. Yeah. I'm be honest with you, I think it's a bad year for that. <laughs> like we've got a lot on our plate. Well, yeah, I'm just saying. Just a wish. Know. Never know. I think I'm ahead still, right? I got six, uh, five left. Okay, wait, I have to do one more. Okay. okay. I want to um, start on some DIY projects around the house. Okay. So, like, do some small renovations, not anything huge. Little stuff around the house. I want to do something huge to oh, the house. You do? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, same. <coughs> Are you okay? No. Yeah. See, that means it's a bad idea. Maybe no big renovations. <laughs> but I do. I want to. I actually same. I want to do some outside renovations to the house. Right. So, like backyard redoing of the backyard. I would like a new car that fits bigger, more stuff. Okay. Well, you can't. Like we're doing that though. You can't pick something we're doing. Can you? Yeah, I already. You're like, already you picked did something it. we're already doing too. <laughs> um, I would like to explore um, around us more. Okay. Like the towns. We kind of had, have already done that, but I'd like to revisit some towns that I really love around us. Okay. I would like to run a run Disney race. Mm. Okay. As well as run more. Okay. Um, it doesn't hurt my body. Yeah, yes. Uh, I would like to go to the beach more. Okay. So we go to the beach once a year, but I want to go more. Right. Like day trips, you know? Okay. I would like to put pictures in all the frames that we've bought. Oh, yeah. I want to put those frames up. All the art that we have, we have so much. When we were cleaning up the nursery, the baby's room, there's so much art in there that needs to go up on the walls. I kind of want to finish like decorating the house. Mm-hmm. I would like to uh, have a kiss from Jen. <laughs> Just like anytime? Just one. 
That's it? The, the whole year? year. No, what? That's a horrible wish. No, just right now. Oh. First well, kiss of 2023. <laughs> First one came true. We did All it. All right. <laughs> I'm one for 12. I know, I did it. Um, I would like to just have a really happy year. I just want to focus on just being happy. Have and a happy not, new year. Not trying to do everything, but just trying to be happy. Right. You know what I mean? At the Grand Canyon. I think sometimes we just try to do so much because we think it will bring us happiness, but sometimes we just need to step back and relax and just enjoy the moment rather than like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I want to enjoy more small moments. Okay. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Star Cruiser was another one of those things Oh, well, that I remember <laughs> that we, were talking that about, we did yeah. this year. Um, Let's go crack some eggs. Those grapes were really good. Yeah, they were. We usually do green grapes, but those red grapes or purple grapes or whatever, that's where it's at. Happy New Year, Jimothy. <laughs> I can't believe Jackson thinks your name is Timifer. <laughs> All right, last step in our New Year's Eve traditions. Oh wait, how does the, how does the pig look? It looks pretty good. Oh, looks yeah. piggy. All right, last step in our New Year's Eve traditions is we crack an egg into a glass of water and then we read it the next morning to try to come up with a prediction as to what's going to happen in 2023. Like, what, is, what does the egg look like? And it always looks the same. We always say it looks like the Eiffel Tower. Uh, mountains. Yeah, mountains. Uh, the, the castle at Disneyland Paris. So I really, really want to try to, like, really try to figure out something else that it looks like this year. Okay. So we'll see. Are you going to do yours first? Yeah. Okay. So we have, we don't have any of the cups that don't have things on them anymore. I think we donated them all. Mm -hmm. Jackson's going to be Armani. Tim's going to be the mustache and I'm going to be the bandit cup. So I totally forgot. We forgot to crack the eggs while Jackson was still awake. Right. So we're going to crack his egg for him, but we're going to see what he thinks it looks like in the morning. Okay. So he's going to be a part of it just in the morning. All right. All crack right, so your egg. Should I crack, crack mine? Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh. Oh, gosh. I don't know, I feel like I'm gonna break my egg. Do it, then you're supposed to. No, I, I mean like, break the yolk. I don't wanna break the yolk. Oh. Maybe I wanna break my yolk. No! Why not? It does. Okay, there it is. Okay, what does it look like so far? Ooh, it's interesting so far. Is it? Yeah. I don't see any tall streakies. Oh, they come in the morning, I think. Oh, I see one, yeah. What does it look like from the top? A bubble. Hmm. So a lot of people in last year's egg said that it looked like, like an ultrasound. Oh, okay. Like a lot of people said that. Okay. I don't know if that was just them like being hopeful for me. But right, like, that's the secret. But it did, it, it came true. So. Right. I mean, you're supposed to put it on your windowsill. Oh, we're running out of windowsill space. I know. I'm going to try to do mine wild. Why? How? Ready? Watch this. Okay. Oh, no. I can't see I'm it. I'm like way up here. No, don't do it. I don't want you to break your yolk. Uh. Oh, yeah. That was a good one. <laughs> Look at how much is going on in there. <laughs> oh, jeez. The perfect egg drop. Wow. It does look pretty, uh, pretty cool. Yeah, there's some stuff going on. Whoa, it already looks, it kind of looks like a Christmas tree. Ooh. Or like a We're roller have coaster. Christmas next year. Kind of looks like a roller coaster. Okay. You got a little bit of water around here. Oh, that's Let's cool. Let's have a look see here. Ooh. Wow. Yeah, what does it look like? Okay, well, we got to let it sit overnight okay. and it'll really form. Tim's going to crack Jackson's egg. All right. Here we go. Look at how tiny his little yolk is. Ooh. How'd that even happen? I don't know. What does it look like so far? Oh, he has like a little dot in the middle. Mmm. All right, so we just got to let our egg sit in the window overnight, and then wow. we'll get up. We'll see what he thinks it looks like. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. Look at mine. Well, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. Looks like the St. Louis Arch. Let's see if it looks like that tomorrow. Okay. It's the next morning. What's it's, the next day? Let's see. What it, What do you think your eggie looks like, bud? Look, look down here, buddy. What do you see? 
I see some orange. Some, some orange? orange? Yeah. Okay. What does it look like? Well, what's this white? I don't know. What does the white look like? Does it? It's like glue. It, it looks, looks like, like glue? glue? Yeah. Hmm. What about the shapes? Do you see anything that rem resembles anything you've seen before? Yeah, I haven't seen this, the other shapes. Oh, what other shapes? Um, Oh, don't, oh. don't shake it up, don't shake it I up. I just need to, I just need to mix it around. Oh, mm. you do? Oh, well, it could be a, a yeah. new way to read your egg, I guess. Yeah, that's enough right there, buddy. Does it, does it look like Whoa, anything look to you? Whoa, look at this. Look at this one. I see it. You know it. what it looked like to me? What? The Golden Gate Bridge. Does it? Yeah. If you can come from my angle. Okay. Let me try to turn it towards you. Okay. Like right around over here. Oh, I kind of see what you mean. The you like see? tall, yeah. Yeah. You know what it looks like to me? What? It kind of looked like a crown. Okay. Like a, like royalty, so yeah. maybe. It kind of looks like me, like pennies. Looks like pennies? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Wow. This also looks like the trail from a rocket launch. Would you like to see a rocket launch this year? Yeah. Yeah? Oh. Okay. See, oh, I thought it. these pennies. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, there's penny. You didn't see the lemon pig yesterday. But That's our lemon pig. You can get out now. We no, have we have to. Fall out. Yeah, they have to fall out. So we got to look at it every morning and see if they fell. Okay. Oh, they need to fall. That's, that's good luck. Yeah, that's the tradition, bud. But I was thinking because I thought it kind of looked like a crown that maybe we could take a trip to the UK. Let me mix it. Um, not right this moment. You want to look at mommy and daddy's eggs? Yeah. Okay, yeah. let's do it. This is my egg. Oh, it's very like... Yours is very compact. Yeah. There's like this weird... Let me see if I can turn it. There's like this weird mass... Let's go dump out. ...over here. Eventually we will, yeah. Yeah, we're going to dump it out after we're done like reading it. I don't know. What does it look like? Oh, there's a valley here. Maybe like the Grand Canyon? Okay, you just really want to go to the Grand Canyon. It kind of reminds me of, and I don't know, but like trees, like canopying trees. Oh, okay. So maybe we're gonna, do you think maybe we're gonna go on like a big hike this year? Yeah. Like through a forest? Yeah. Maybe? Would you like that? Yeah. You would? Hi, little babe. You think the little babe would like that? Yeah. Okay. So what do you think it looks like from the top? I'm not really getting any... Yours is very... Kind of not a lot going on in there. Yeah, leave some comments and let me know what... If you see anything. Because I... Of course I want to say that it looks like... Oh, come right here. There's like a tunnel right here. A tunnel? Yeah, oh, yeah, that's... like a train tunnel. Oh, you think... Maybe think... you're going to go on a train trip. Oh, that would be cool. Yeah. Yeah, it kind of looks like a mountain with like trees on top, those are the trees, and then you take a train through the tunnel through the mountain. Ooh, okay. Ooh. So that kind of plays into mine. Check this out. Okay. My, my dumpy. Almost, move, almost, almost. Move mine. Almost. Which one is mine? Mine looks like a big cave. Well, yours has like this very tall peak. Like the Apple Tower. It does look like the this Eiffel Tower. One, it looks we always, exactly like the Eiffel Tower. We always say the like, Eiffel Tower, but this time it's really, really true. But like, I think that this part right here looks like a cave. Yeah. Right? Like what do you think, Jackson? Can you see it? Yeah. You're going to a mountains. What do you think it looks like? And we're uh, gonna go I spelunking. Think it looks like uh, glasses. It looks like, like glasses? glasses? Okay. Okay. All right, I like that. It's in, he's in, it's interpretive, you know? Like. So you're saying that this year I, I will need glasses. Okay. Almost, buddy, almost. Yeah. I, wow, yeah. Look at it jiggle. It looks very... I don't know. Yeah, this is a hard one. Yours is hard. I, I think it looks it like looks, a cave. It looks just like the Eiffel Tower. It really does. But also, like, there's snow on the ground, right? Like, mm. so maybe we're going to go to Paris in the winter time. I don't want to do that. Why? No, I don't like the snow. What? Sorry. Even in Paris? Yeah. I've never been to Paris this though, but I know <laughs> that they are icy streets. Oh, okay. In the winter in Paris, and I don't, I don't have a lot of experience with ice. Yeah. You want to dump them out? Okay. So okay. I think, I think we're done interpreting our eggs. I have it myself. But leave some comments down below if you saw something that we didn't see, because I'm curious to see what you thought. All right, buddy. Did you have fun interpreting your eggs? Yeah, I just. We turn them into the sink into the water. <laughs>
Oh, they went to the water treatment plant. Yeah, so anytime that it, we flush the toilet or, or put something down the sink, he knows that it goes to the water, treatment, the water plant. treatment plant. So now they're gonna have our our eggs. All right, well thank you, thank you for helping us, buddy. So there you have it. That was New Year's Eve with the trackers. <laughs> And Miley Cyrus and Dolly. We literally only watched the last 47 seconds of their show. So but it they, was good. It was they weren't really a part of it, yeah. Yeah, they were a tiny part of it. But so I hope that your New Year's Eve was more eventful than ours was. I feel like this, it gets less eventful every year, but- um, Yeah, I think it'll be like a bell curve. You think? Yeah, like it'll be less eventful until like the kids get older and then it'll be like then the they other, can you know, the be like way. a part of it. Yeah, they'll yeah. stay up. They'll like we'll light off fireworks. I was kind of sad that Jackson, not sad. He he needs to sleep because you know he's only three. But I wish that he could have stayed up and like done some of the stuff with us. You know. Right. So I don't soon soon, but next year we'll have another baby for New Year's. Right. It'll be so, it'll be just like New Year's, not last year, not last year, but the year before. Right. When Jackson was literally just born. He was like a month old. Yeah. So. It wasn't very exciting that year. No, it wasn't. But because <laughs> <laughs> he, he he like kept us up all night. So um, I don't know. I'm I'm super excited for what's to come this year. I can't wait to see if our grape wishes come true. I can't wait to see what the uh, what the eggs look like in the morning. Right. I'm just I'm just excited for 2023. It's gonna be a good year. I think so, I really do. And I hope that it's a really good year for you guys too. I know it will be. Leave some comments down below and let us know if you guys have any big plans for the year, big goals, big like, like what, are your, what do you wanna do in 2023? I wanna know, what are you doing? I wanna tell you something. What? A secret shame of mine. What? I feel like I'm not gonna run tomorrow. Oh. I just said I was gonna do it. <laughs> but like, I have to get up at five and it's one o'clock in the morning now. Yeah, I'm not judging. This 2023 is the year of no judgments for me. Okay. Because I'm not gonna run tomorrow. All right. <laughs> like, in in this body, no. In this economy. <laughs> in this economy. <laughs> so uh, I'm definitely not judging you. Yeah. I think 2023 should be the year of do what makes you happy, and who cares what everybody else thinks. Okay. That's what I. That's my motto. All right. So there you go. So again, thank you for being such a big part of our year. Thank you for watching the videos. Thank you for allowing us to do what we do. Yeah. If you didn't watch the videos, we couldn't do what we do. So thank you so much for being here right now. Thank you guys. Yeah. Uh, I cannot believe how good of a New Year's Eve we had. It was so much fun. I can't believe how our eggs turned out. I can't believe that mine looked like the Eiffel Tower at winter or a cave. It was amazing. Yeah, it and really you... was. What about yours? I can't believe that mine looked like a train ride through the mountains. Wow. Right? Blow, mind blowing. <laughs> mind blowing. It's wild. Yeah. And Jackson's? I mean, oh. wow. Come on. <laughs> yeah. I. Who knew? Who knew that he would be doing the Golden Gate Bridge? This year. Not me. Oh. Yeah. Well, there you have it. All in all, it was a fantastic day. And we wish you a happy new year. Yes. And with that being said, we are off. We'll see you guys tomorrow. And, and now, now it's time, time to pay, pay the, the price. price. Happy New Year. Happy New Year.